What's up guys, I'm Mike. Woo! This is the great outside. All right, we're hiking again. And it's windy. We're at the Pine Knob parking area off of 70. Hitting the AT, heading to Dahlgren for the night. Should only take a few hours to get there. And then hopefully we're gonna make it to Harper Ferry. I'll probably break this whole trip into a couple videos. So let's get on with it. I think we have about four miles till Dahlgren. Sun's trying to poke out. Kinda nice. Break time a little bit. Decent view through the trees, huh? I can feel her right there, but I still had to stop. She needed a break. This hell pretty steep. Whew. All right, we got Boomerang Dan and Kentucky Bubbles. Hello. All right. Yep. <laughs> All right, that's cool. We're gonna put you guys in the video. Well, thank you. Sure do appreciate it. Yeah, look out in a couple weeks. It's the Great Outside channel. Great Outside, yes. <laughs> All right, you guys be safe. Yes, sir. Have a good one. Thank you. You as well. Oh, Later, I guess sir. I should bring these, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, have a good one. All right, you too. This is the Washington Monument, not the one you're thinking of, but a different one. I so desperately want to go up there. Hello! dangerously close to Dahlgren. There's a church that uh, those two very interesting people told me I'd see right around then. So, too bad I don't have a bunch of money. Apparently you can get beer and pizza there. <laughs> Got a little new gear. This is a three by five by three by five or 11 and a half by 11 and a half foot DD tarp. Um, this is the best purchase I've made in a long time. Uh, it was expensive. I paid $90, which is outrageous for my channel. I don't spend that kind of money, but damn, is it useful. And this thing is amazing. This was not that hard to do, you know, seeing it on. YouTube, I was a little uh, intimidated. You know, tie this out. But what I'm gonna do, sorry, that's a bad view. What I'm gonna do to keep warm, cause it's gonna get cold tonight. I'm gonna bring these in and tie them together like that with a toggle through one, like this. And that should keep as much heat in as possible. Like this is my hike and bike tent pad, just to give you some perspective. My hike and bike Zion 2 person. 
I still got a ton of room to go. This is awesome. This is awesome. I am so glad I bought this. Wow. So awesome. Jet. All right, before it gets dark, I love this thing. This is awesome. So much room. That's just amaze balls, yo. Badass. I might uh, hop in later, but probably see in the morning. Well, I looked at the map. <clears throat> Our next stop is at Garvey today. All right, we're all packed up, left no trace, and we are out headed to Crampton Gap. We've only got five miles to go. It took way too long getting packed, but it doesn't really matter. I'm just not used to taking that long. I was a little lazy this morning. It was too quiet to film last night. Like there was four other hikers there but they were all being dead quiet. <laughs> so I felt a little weird. So if you were wondering what you're probably not, that's why there really wasn't that much footage from last night. But tonight, I will hopefully have a different scenario and we can get some shots setting up that new tarp now that I have practice from last night. That was one of the coolest camping experiences I've had yet. Try to get over your head so you're not on camera. Appreciate it. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thanks. New Hi, nice to meet you. Wow, look at that view. This is this is arguably better than Annapolis Rock. Really? That's a nice view. That is an amazing view. <laughs> got about an hour left, and I can set up camp. It seems like we're here. Yeah. Finally. Yeah, we are here. Right on. Whew. What do you think, Breathe? Where do you want to go? Took me too long. I'm exhausted. I'm, I'm just exhausted. It's not that big of a deal. I'm just exhausted. All right, that's what I got. Right here, got. Yeah, I made two doors. I just pulled that out front so it would hold the uh, pole. I'm using my stick, one of my two hiking sticks. Uh, that way it holds the pole upright and um, then I tied it out flat around here pull it in these two corners and then pulled that out around down to there so from the back yeah that's your profile and then come around that way I've got this peg down, and I can just come in and out here. And you can see how much room I have in there. It's ridiculous. Absolutely redonk. So that's gonna work. Now I really am gonna chill. Yeah, I'm getting ready to hunker down and get warm. I do my best to whatever. 
I'm saying whatever. I just can't stop saying whatever. Whatever. Uh, yeah. Well, for some reason, everybody decided to go camping at 10 o'clock at night. I was literally watching a, a show. And people were all over the place trying to find campsites. I haven't even gone out there to pee yet. I promise that there's tents everywhere. Right, look. Ridiculous. Uh, there's more down the hill behind me. Blech. I'm really not that much of a people person. Uh, there's a sunrise though. Yay. There. Well, I'm pretty much at peace with Stan. My left knee is really bothering me. So, we're going to do that. Um, I'm waiting until all these people finish packing out. Alright, did you see them? There you go. And then, I'm going to go scavenge for all the crap they dropped. See if I can find a long reach spoon. And maybe relocate to somewhere I can set this up a little better. I did bring... <laughs> I did bring a, uh, a hammock. So, I could technically make a, a hammock shelter. I don't know. I'm going to play with it. I just got to wait a few hours for all these people to roll out and then go see if there's a better spot. There may or may not be, but either way, we're here tonight. God, all that took me way too long. So long. Oh, this this tarp comes with a learning curve. But I still love it. I'm going to learn it. And then I won't have to curve it. All right. This thing blends so well. This is the craziest uh, camo pattern I've ever used. I'm not real big into camo. I'm just starting to get there now. But this blends in crazy. This is what we're working with now. I put it this way, it's 11 and a half. So I put it this way so I can flip the doors down later and have it pretty close to the ground. That's why I brought like a nine and a half foot uh, shitty hammock. Hate that hammock, but it works, serves its purpose. And I've got the back. Set up like this for now. <laughs> Told you so. What are you gonna do? It's a hiking trail. Not a wild camp. I guess I can't complain, right? Shouldn't. I can't. I can always complain. I just shouldn't complain. There. Check this out. Not bad, huh? Yeah, this is gonna work just fine. All right, well, let's do it this way. So it, <clears throat> it's raining that you can hear. <laughs> and uh, we're hunkered down. It's just reaching dark and uh, that's that's about it I am so exhausted today this trip has busted me I don't know why but it definitely has busted me up <laughs> so I'm crashing sign art I mean, I'll tell you that was wild it rained all night and I fell asleep and woke up to hard rain. We had puddles inside. By the time I figured it out, she was sleeping on my backpack. I felt terrible. Found a tick crawling on my ear. Man, what a night. Still slept really good though. But when I woke up, 
every single person was gone. That's crazy, except for one person. There. Well, I'm drying everything out and packing it up. I really love this tarp. That was... Well, it was not a rough night for me. I just felt really bad for Breezy. It turns out where she was laying was dry, but most of the night I didn't think that it was. It really... Setting up over this tent pad was a bad idea. It collected water. I should have set up over between those two trees where I wanted to. Yeah, spring, spring, and look at how pretty that is. The light coming through the green trees. We're pretty much here. <clears throat> this is pretty cool. That's one thing I do like about Maryland for sure, is all its old architecture. I must have been a mason in my last, last life because I love stonework. Eighteen eighty-seven, apparently. Very cool. Well, we're here. Uh, well, hopefully this video turned out to be something decent. Um, please like and subscribe for more videos like this one. If it did turn out decent, and if not, just maybe throw me a bone and subscribe anyway. And if not, then that's okay. Don't subscribe. You have a wonderful day. <laughs> Jeez. Go outside and challenge yourself. It's great out here.